Jack knew Rusty was gay. That's why he hated him. Ah, oh, people are turds on so many levels. It's the same idiots mouthing off. No, no idea what they're saying or, or what it does to us. Jack wasn't a homophobe. You know who he was. You don't need to question that because of some small-minded troll. Mm. No, it's not going away. I think I need to tell Jess about the drugs. You know, Brian says it won't make a difference, but I think she needs to know. I'm not supposed to tell you this. Oh, we both know you're going to say it. She's pregnant. <laughs> no. how, how long has she known? Not very long. She didn't even tell me. I only found out because I saw the test in her rubbish bin. Oh, shit. She's OK, but I don't think she needs anything else to worry about right now. Do you? No. Where have you been? Take a guess. You're supposed to be learning your lines. It's one line. What is it? I'm not saying it. It's because you don't know it. No, it's because I'm refusing to say it. <laughs> I saw the statement on TV. You spoke beautifully. And you looked very handsome. <sighs> Gotta say, I'm not surprised about Rusty. Really? He's never hit on me. Not once. I've never even caught him having a sneaky perv. OK. You know what that means. Felsen, Wyatt, Giovanni, all gay. Because they didn't hit on you. Just mathematically, there must be hundreds. <laughs> it seems everyone has an opinion on this. We've got Sandy on the line. I think Angie McLeish's slip about getting cubicles in the shower says it all. And what is that specifically? It's just that closed mentality, isn't it? You know, who wants to deal with that? Clearly O'Reilly wanted to deal with it, or he wouldn't have come out. Why didn't you talk to me first? Because I knew you wouldn't want me to do it. No, I wouldn't want you to do it for me. I was sick of watching you get beaten up by the press. Russ, none of this has ever been about me. Well, maybe I just wanted them off your back for a minute. Maybe I needed an excuse. I, mean, I was always going to do it sooner or later. Thank you. You didn't have to disappear like that. You scared a lot of people. Yeah, well, the media's camped out at my house. Stay here. You know, the whole point's to prove that we're not shagging. As if I'd shag you. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, you are only human. Ah, you're such a nerd. <laughs> <laughs>